There's something weird going on with birds lately. Have you noticed anything strange? We've been living in this house for a few years now and have a number of birds that come through the area, one of which is the yellow-billed magpie. I love this bird. It's beautiful. It's got black and white and a yellow bill and really stark colors that are just beautiful. And we notice them and they come in every now and then, sometimes in twos or threes, but lately, ever since the wildfire started, we've been seeing them come in in, in flocks of like 15 to 20 and they hang out in our yard. It's just weird. It's weird because it hasn't happened like this before. I wonder, my question is, is this related to the wildfires? Hmm. There's something else that's going on in the area east of California. So Arizona, Texas, New Mexico, they are experiencing massive die-off of birds in the last few weeks. Really strange, just falling out of the sky or they're sitting on the ground and they're acting weird. They're usually shy around people and then they're just kind of hanging out while people walk up to them. This is something that is a mystery. We don't know what's going on and we're trying to find out. Now, here are some possibilities. First of all, it could be the smoke, like the smoke was maybe displacing the magpies from different places in California, and that's why I'm seeing so many more magpies in my yard. Maybe that's it. Maybe the smoke is affecting their lungs. The lungs of a bird could be developing too many particulates in them from the smoke, and they're suffocating to death. I want to tell you a little bit about the lungs of a bird, because I bet you don't know. Bird lungs are different than human lungs. This is human lungs. Human lungs are two big sacs connected by one windpipe and they the air goes in, it goes into the sacs, they inhale, exhale, they push the same air back out but now it is more carbon dioxide than oxygen. That is human. Bird lungs are more like this. It is pretty much one opening, one tube that divides and air goes down one tube, out the other tube. So it's a one-way air system for birds. Air, they have little sacs along the side that help move the air along. They have got lungs that absorb the oxygen into their bloodstream. But the air doesn't go in and out the same tube. It goes in one tube and out another tube. Another thing that could be affecting the birds is insects. If the insects are something that those birds are eating and they're relying on the insects for their food and the insects are not there because of the smoke in the air, the, maybe their habitats have been burned up, and maybe these birds are dying of starvation. The other thing is birds are starting to migrate now. As they move during the colder fall months, they start moving towards the south so that they have warmer climate during the winter and a lot of these birds are moving there. Maybe they're having a problem with their migration because of the smoke. Maybe they're getting confused and disoriented. Maybe they're deciding to sit this out until the smoke goes away. I don't know, and I hope we find out. There is an app, I will put a link in the comments for, if you see a dead bird, you take a picture of it, you upload it, because they're trying to identify exactly where is this happening, how much is this happening. I want you, and my students, to come up with questions. What are some questions that would be investigating questions that we could help find the answer to this mystery? Have a great day, guys. I'm gonna leave some links to birds and migration and how lungs work in the comments.